look at this. Meet one of the worst invasive plants in the Midwest, European buckthorn, Ramnus cathartica. Learn what the leaves look like, see those navy blue berries, bird dispersed birds, eat them and shit them out. Got that one inch long green petiole, a little bit of a mildly serrate margin on the leaves right there, and then of course that distinct venation. Almost looks like a Ceanothus at times, which a Ceanothus is a native member of this same family, but this is so bad, brought here because some turd thought it was aesthetically uh, pleasing, just whimsically, whimsically uh, aesthetic, whimsically attractive, you know, because no context for ecology, no context for what's native or not, just, oh, it looks kind of nice, and it's a filler plant, and it turned out it does really well here, and it has none of the native fungi or insects to keep it in check back home in Europe. And so it just runs loose and it overtakes the forest preserve and creates this dense thicket in the understory, slowly wiping out our spring ephemerals. The spring ephemerals in Illinois, the claytonias, the trilliums, the, the trout lilies, erythroniums, all right, they occupy that, uh, I don't know, three or four week window of time when temperatures are just starting to warm up in the spring, but the leaves haven't come out on the trees yet. And so that's an ecological niche and they do it well. And you'll see all these cool wildflowers blooming in the understory. Buckthorn wipes them out, all right? Buckthorn's also a great habitat for ticks. If I were to walk about 20, 30 feet in there, it'd come out with like five or six ticks on me. The deer hide out in here, creates a nice thicket for them. The ticks feed on the deer, you get just a shit ton of ticks, all right? This, ideally this needs to burn, but uh, but barring that, just go in there and just snip all this stuff down. Cut the cut the stumps. I'd like to do it maybe a foot up and then spot apply herbicide. All right. All these all these crunchy dreadlock warriors think that you know herbicide is going to kill you. It's not. All right. It's not depleted uranium. All right. If you're not you're not getting tantric Indian massages in glyphosate. You don't, don't lather it on yourself. You want to minimize exposure, but but just little spot applications with a sprayer onto just the stumps, the cut stumps of the buckthorn is not going to kill you. It's much better to be doing that, all right, than it is to be having buckthorn just running rampant and leading to local extinctions, extirpations of all those cool spring ephemerals. Go in there with the snippers, with a sawzall, and then relatively soon after you cut, you got to get that glyphosate or any of the other herbicides on there so that it gets sucked into the uh, internal plumbing of the plant and kills it. And there's, there's, this is what so much of Cook County Forest Reserves look like. It is fucking tragic. I mean, I see this and I just see extinction. I see local extinction. I see extirpation of all those cool spring ephemerals. Dozens of species of wildflowers that occupy that ecological niche of the, uh, you know, that window of time when temps are warming up before the leaves have come out in early spring that just you don't get anymore because they've been choked up by the buckthorn. Not to mention the ticks, not to mention it creates those actual thorns on it that poke you and just suck, all right? And learn what the bark looks like too. See, almost kind of looks like, like ribbons. See that? The leaves with that inch-long green petiole, mildly serrate margin, distinct leaf pattern venation, and, uh, and the bark. One of the, one of the worst invasives probably... Uh, one of the worst cases of invasion biology in all of North America. All right, but again, it's primarily you only get it in the Midwest. So anyway, and it's important where it's native, right? Back home in Europe, right? Important, uh, important member of the ecosystem. Here, it's a fucking disaster. Kill it. Kill it all, all right? You just cut, spot apply herbicide. Anyway, that's all I got. Go fuck yourself. Bye. Look at it. That shouldn't look like that. That should be open, okay? This could be a, this could be a relatively bright, lightly shaded understory of an oak forest. Instead, it's just dense with, with the fucking buckthorn and you got those hostas too. It's another horticultural atrocity, another pain plant from Midwest landscaping. Ugh. But look at that. Look at how thick that is. Couldn't walk through it. And you get stabbed because again, it's the name buckthorn is real. It does get those little thorns on it. It's just the branches terminate into a spine. Get rid of it. Kill it with fire or glyphosate.